This question is about trigonometry and it has to do with arc length and sector area. So the very first question here, we're given a circle here and this is the very center of it. I guess I can call it O. Uh, there we go. Assuming it's the O origin. And it goes like this. There's A, then O, then C. And we're given that the radius is 40 uh, units here. In this case right here, do they tell us the units? Yeah, this is 40 centimeters section. We know that this angle here is 1.9 radians, okay? So we know that that's the angle. And now first we want the length of ABC. And good news, this is actually really easy. If you recognize what to do, you can recognize that what we're looking for here is the arc length. And if we want the arc length, then we just need to look in our uh, formula booklet and look it up, but it says L equals theta R. That's it, that's the equation we need to use. Now you don't have to memorize it, right? You just look it up. So that's, I think, a useful one right there. So that's a good one to use. And now, if we go back here, so we're trying to then use this. It's just nice and easy. We just go L equals theta, which in this case is just 1.9. This equation only works if your angle is in radians. So that's why this is indeed in radians. And then R is the radius, which is 40. We can bring up our trusty calculator to do that. And remember, if you're using a TI Inspire, it helps to, uh, you know, do maybe a new document, for example, or do a calculator. And I'll just go 1.9 times 40. And there we go. So 76. So that's our answer. So it equals 76. Now you have to think, what are the units? If they gave it lengths so here are centimeters, it helps to put in 76 centimeters. There we go.